Hi guys, today I'm going to show how to install uh, Cyanogen Mode 9 which is version uh, 0.4 It is an official one in Samsung Galaxy Y GTS 5360 So first of all you will need a compatible uh, kernel with it that is called uh, White EXP I have even uh, introduced a tutorial on how to install the White EXP or flash it you have to flash this white exp kernel uh, with your Odin before you proceed with this procedure so now uh, I'm all, I have already uh, flashed the kernel which is white exp first of all so let's go through the procedure power off your phone And now you have to go uh, to the recovery mode uh, for that you have to press your power button volume up button and home button simultaneously as the logo comes you can leave the buttons Here you are on the clockwork recovery mode as it is uh, it is a default for uh, the white exp kernel uh, so here you can see the touch is disabled and you have to scroll up and down with your volume up and volume down button selection with your home button and coming back with your sense and uh, first of all we have to do is we have to format the system for that you have to go to mount and storage and uh, you can see over here there is a option at the third option from down it is format system select the format system and click yes it takes a little while to format the system as it is doing a big work it is formatting the system It takes a little while please do not panic with it yeah it's finished and now you have to mount the first four there is an option straight over here and you can see the system is showing mount so click on that so that it will get mounted the first show first four should be mounted come back Now after coming back uh, you have to wipe data and wipe cache partition the third option wipe data click yes it is wiping data and resetting the files It is finished now the fourth option below the wipe data is wipe cache partition click on it and uh, select yes why it is wipe caching uh, and now uh, you have to clear the Dalvik cache for that you have to go to the last option it is advanced and there is a second option wipe Dalvik cache and select yes that's all and come come back now okay uh, now uh, you have to it is the last step install zip from SD card then choose zip from SD card and select the file which we want to flash that is uh, CM9 unofficial click on it and select yes it's now opening the update package and installing the update this well, this is the thing which takes a little time so please don't panic with the procedure 
please let it take a time to install please follow the steps carefully to get a success to install the room it is installing the update this takes a little while after the installation gets completed it shows that install from SD card is completed so please don't worry it takes a little time please wait as it is installing the update it takes a little while as you can see the process is almost to finish and you can see the message is there install from SD card uh, completed now come back and click on the first option which is reboot system now that will reboot your system it's rebooting now as it is the first reboot it will take a little while after all is set down then it will be pretty smooth to work and if you see this Samsung Galaxy UI Young logo for more than five minutes you can press your power button for more than 10 seconds uh, when it will show black screen you can leave it so that it it will be prevented from the boot loop coming in and now it's a uh, rebooting this take a little while please do not panic yeah you can see over here it's a boot animation of cyanogen mode 9 it is rebooted successfully this plays a little while because it's the first boot and boot it will take a little while to load the home page and we are able to flash the Cyanogen mode 9 because only because of the kernel flashed before that is white exp kernel so please uh, do flash the kernel before you go through this procedures it will take a little time to load the home page it's come to the home page now that's pretty cool some two to five error one or two errors are there in this room you can see it is quite good for smoothness yeah you can see over here that's good and you can see the camera doesn't work in this room so you have to fly take some application from your Play Store it's quite good room but few errors there can be an update after few months or weeks if the update comes or we will be making you notified soon with a video tutorial how to install it at a glance I will show you the settings you can see over here this is the kernel version it is white exp that is the only reason how we could we are able to boot up with the cyanogen mode 9 and i'll show you the android version it's 4.0.4 ice cream sandwich keep on pressing it that's pretty cool from android boots flying hmm, that's a good one these are the these are those setting you can see over here it's switching type you can take your lock screens themes you can download more themes from your 
from your play store this is a home and only four four widgets at the top no more toggles as you know in cyanogen mode you don't have much toggles there's only the problem is only the problem is camera that will be fixed very soon so please wait for the next update or if you like with that camera you can flash it or take the application from the Android market that's all with this video it is a pretty good room thank you for watching this video please comment if you have any problem into the installation or and please do subscribe to my channel thank you for watching have a good day